Hello, I'm Master Sorapis, the founder of Sephiroth School, where we help you make sense of spiritual science and technology in order to further your growth and speed up your spiritual evolution. In our last video, we spoke about four key or fundamental numbers used in most spiritual practices. Those numbers are 3, 7, 9, and 12. Today, we'll talk about the significance of number 3. The first thing I want to reference is the Holy Trinity, or the Trimurti. Different world religions and cultures believe in God's diverse manifestation or qualities. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, Brahma, Vishnu, and Shiva, Osiris, Isis, and Horus, Buddha, Dharma, and Sangha, the three emanations from Einsolf, nothingness, wisdom, and understanding, and that list goes on and on. In spiritual practices, we have a distinct separation when talking about your soul or monad, when we learn to distinguish between self, not self, and higher self. Yourself is the current incarnation of your monad in your existing physical body. Not self is all your past, future, and present reincarnations from parallel worlds. Your higher self is you perceiving yourself not as an individual anymore, but as all of your reincarnations, your monad as one. So number three has been an important instrument in human history to describe different analogies, hierarchies, representations, symbols, and more. The ancient Greeks believed number three meant harmony, wisdom, and understanding. Whether it's religion, philosophy, parapsychology, or magic, the frequency of number three, its meaning, is pretty significant. When we study the 22 energies of the planet Earth, we learn that the third energy means the entire principle of the yin sign. Just imagine. Everything in this world, and even the entire universe, is dual. It consists of either yin or yang energy principles. So the number three represents half of that. That's pretty powerful, isn't it? That third energy is also depicted on the third card of the major arcana of tarot, the Empress, which represents birth, both the living nature and the female nature, to matter. There are many other symbolic values and interpretations and sacred meanings of the number three. You can learn more about them by studying esoteric and occult sciences and practicing spiritual technologies. Stay tuned, because next time we'll talk about number seven. I'm Master Sorapis. Thank you for learning with Sephiroth School.